All right, so we have your all wrapped up, and the wife found a box, so let's get her in there. Only problem is she fit before, she doesn't fit now. Just miss it, and I'm packing her in real tight, so I'm concerned. And we're gonna use all the plastic we used for painting as padding. Now, we've cleaned up and replaced the resin in this, cleaned that one. So now we have four printers ready to go, which is just in time because something happened. A painter in Malton from, oh. Well, he told us that I didn't put one of the envelopes in the order that we just sent out to him. Since we had two people in the order and it had, usually has a thank you card and a kissy, and then the artist on the back, along with some nice little stickers. But I only sent one of them, so I was gonna send another, but going all the way to Italy is kind of a lot of work. Uh, and it cost like $17 and I was like, oh, wait a minute. I have another figure that I'm gonna send to him and it was like gonna be months down the road. Not months, but at least a month in order to get there. But now we have a reason to print it. It's that Hyper Futa uh, One Piece thing where the, the, the it's so big. Uh, so we're rushing that. So now we have four printers ready to go and we, it's gonna take five prints to get it out, but we're gonna do the base here and all four are gonna be printing that giant peen. Let's get to you looking at what did come out today while I tell you a story. So I got a quote on a website today where somebody's gonna build me a website uh, and they said it's gonna be $6,000 to build a site from scratch. So it'll have like little scrolling icons and stuff. I have planned to get uh, my little chibi Freyas on the top banner bar and every new page. It'll cycle through one or two or three. Uh, and it'll have a pay function and all that. But does anybody know if that's like a good deal or not? Because I have no idea. Dealing with websites is it's something new to me. So if anybody has any insight on building websites from scratch, can you give me some advice or have ever paid for a website before? Because I really don't know what I'm doing. Also, fun story. You know how I have that account on Colts 3D that you can use, I give you the password and email and you can log in and look at all the spicy stuff? Remember that? Well, somebody's taken that email and keeps trying to do stuff with it. They bought, like, inhaler supplies uh, once, like, a long time ago. They tried to sign up for uh, another website with it. Don't know why. And then, just yesterday, I got an... Somebody tried to set up an OnlyFans account with that email. Why? Why are you... Why would somebody do that? Gonna try and be me and upload pictures of girls? Some girl? I mean, okay, but I have to confirm the email address and you're not gonna get that to happen. But if somebody wants to go online and post naked bodies and say, hey, this is Freya, go ahead. I might actually like it. So, joke's on you. What did you forget? I'm a lesbian. Why do you think I print all these titties? Although I think it's more that I just appreciate the female form and I like the shape of it because it's curvy and soft and I like that, and men don't have that. Also, I'm starting to realize that the washing detergent might actually be much better than the rubbing alcohol, because I filled this, like, last week, maybe two weeks ago, and it's already disgusting. And this, it's settled, but, like, It worked for like a month. Now granted you have to wash everything each time, but you kinda have to do that with alcohol anyways. And I just so happen to have most of another gallon here. Or liter, five liters, I don't know how much a liter is. How long has that tail for Carlock been back there? Jesus, I cannot wait to like clean this out. And there's stuff under here. There's figures that I just don't have time to paint. So I'm gonna be auctioning those off as well. Maybe this weekend. We'll see. How would I even do an auction? 
Maybe I can make a Google Docs and make it accessible to everybody to look at, and then I post the picture, and then what the correct bid is, and I update it every time I can throughout the week. Highest bidder goes next, and I put their name, and then you can decide if you want it or not. What is going on? There are times when I this thing just, look at it die. Look, oh, there it goes. It just doesn't read the drives. Like it, or I, it'll start, and then it won't like say, oh, here's the file, here's the long it's gonna take. It just goes, yeah, there's a file there, and nothing happens. And now I have to like smother it with a pillow and wait for it to finally power off completely and then restart it. Point is, this thing is buggy. But once you get around the bugs, it's okay. Now, there is like a big cabinet size printer that I was looking at that I've been told I cannot have but it might be better because the head moves on that thing instead of the bed and it might be better for printing big things maybe it's like three thousand dollars or something which is half the cost of a website I'm gonna have to get the website I need it I just hope it's easily customizable but also, this list, the person who's selling this to me wasn't even selling for websites. They were making chibi art. They're like, we can also do websites because I mentioned it. And I'm like, that's not in your description at all. But let's go ahead. Tell me what you can do. That's also why I'm kind of hesitant because, like, I don't, I don't know if I should be trusting this or not. We'll see if it works this time. There we go. Has anybody seen D.Va? I have not seen D.Va in a while. We got her base finished, and I mean, that's supposed to hold her up? This is a bad model. I should have told them no. I really should have, because I can spot a bad model when I see it, and I immediately saw this when I went, that's gonna be a problem. I did say no to somebody who had a figure that was from League of Legends. She was kind of like a sheep wizard or something. I don't know. But all the cuts were just straight lines, straight cuts. And it, I was like, that's not that's not gonna go together. It it can't. It'll just fall apart. Alright, we got our four printers going. Uh, I'm gonna try and set up the vampire girl today. And I'll talk to you all later. Bye.